So if you close your eyes and breathe, focusing your breath, and the breath is the bridge between the body and your spirit, your higher self and unconscious mind, the breath. With your breath, imagine you could breathe in light from the universe around you. Light from the sun, the stars, into every cell of the body. And anywhere you're holding lower frequency energies from the 3D matrix, the mutant matrix, on the outbreath, release that energy back to the light. Release other people's energy, especially emotional or mental energy. Release emotional energies. There's a lot of angst and fear and anxiety and anger in the 3D matrix. Release anywhere you've absorbed it because star seeds are naturally absorbent. Releasing back to the light and allow more of your own authentic light into every cell of the body. And imagine breathing in light from the universe around you, from the stars, the sun and the earth below, into the bones of the body, the skeletal system. All joints or vertebrae from the skull, the jaw, the neck, the spine. Light. Releasing back to the universe anything not light anything stagnant or toxic or stuck. Allowing that light, so all the way down the spine and then expanding out to the rib cage, collarbone, shoulder blades, light into the body. Anywhere the joints or vertebrae are holding stuck energies, give permission for your body to release, purge. Release it out, allowing more light into your field, allowing more flexibility, more fluidity into your field. Expanding the light out into the arms and hands, all joints of the wrists, the elbows and shoulder joints. Releasing anything that's not yours back to the light. And also in the pelvic area that can often hold a lot of old energies, ancestral energies. Release and purge from your body, all energies out from your field. Allow more light to return to you and then legs and feet, all joints of the ankles, knees and hip joints, releasing anything you've picked up, absorbed from the matrix of a lower frequency nature back to the light. and allowing more light into the whole field. Expanding the light into the whole field. And imagine you could breathe light from the universe around you, 360 degrees into the blood and blood producing parts of the body. Anywhere you're holding ancestral programming, bloodline programming, bloodline stories in the blood, release on the outbreath back to the light. Anything limiting you or blocking you or inhibiting you from the bloodlines, release any interference from the bloodlines back to the light. Allowing more of your own natural energy to return to you. and breathing light into all systems of the body, all organs of the body. 
raising the light frequency of your field. And releasing anything that's not yours back to the light. And I call to your team and spirit of the highest light and resonance, your higher self, monadic self, your I am presence, or helpers, guides, angels, archangels, star councils, galactic council, Elohim. Come be with you now. Come be with you now. And allow the inner channel to open between heaven and earth, crown and base, open. Allow all chakras within the body to begin to expand as spheres of light. As you allow more light into the body, crown chakra opens, there's a great sphere of light opens. Allowing light from the central sun into the crown. All layers, levels, dimensions. Base chakra opens at the same time. A great sphere of light for the base and the crown are connected. Allow light from the earth, from Gaia, to expand into the base, all layers, levels, dimensions. So crown and base, which have a natural affinity, opening together. And breathe and open. Third eye opens in the center of the head. Opens, allowing more light into all layers, levels, dimensions from the central sun. And at the same time, sacral opens in the belly area. A great sphere of light, absorbing light from Gaia, the grid of the earth. And the third eye and sacral have a natural affinity and naturally connected. So the crown and base, the third eye and sacral opening. And throat opens. Solar plexus opens. Throat and solar plexus opens. They have a natural affinity. Throat, a sphere of light, absorbing light from the central sun. and the solar plexus absorbing light from Gaia, the crystalline grid of the Earth. And these two have a natural affinity, allow them to awaken together. And then the heart opens, in the center of the being, the heart opens. Heart opens. and allow all these chakras to be upgraded. Some of them may want to receive some new light codes. And light codes can come through in many forms. It can come through as geometric patterning, color, sound, light, light language. Just allowing light from the earth grid and light from the central sun to begin to speak to your chakra system.
Below the feet, the Earth Star Chakra, some 18 inches below the feet, opens in the Earth, opens. Connecting you to the planet, opens. A great sphere of light in the Earth opens. Allow light into that sphere from Gaia, from the crystalline grid. Dissolve all cords to the old grid of the Earth, the old karmic grid of the Earth, and allow light in and aligning with the crystalline grid of the Earth. Release any toxic energies from the bloodlines that you're still picking up in the Earth Star Chakra. Any toxic programming, toxic stories, toxic belief systems, toxic energies. Give permission to release. You don't need them anymore. Purge them and allow more light into the Earth star so it becomes a pulsing star in the Earth, a pulsing star of perhaps a kind of coppery golden light in the Earth pulsing. Releasing all interference from the bloodlines, mother, father line. Dissolving any interference from the 3D matrix through the bloodlines. Releasing all abuse from the bloodlines, or fear from the bloodlines, or violence, or anger, or entrapment, or guilt. Release all these old stories. You don't have to carry, I should say, those energies. They serve no more purpose for you. You need to bring in new energies and transform the old and release them. Allow the Earth Star to become a pulsing, coppery golden sun in the, in the Earth below your feet. Increasing your connection to the light of the earth. And as this happens, above your head, some 18 inches, the soul star opens. The soul star opens. A great sphere of light opens. You could see this as perhaps the primary color would be a kind of magenta. There may be golds and whites there, but there's a magenta color. The soul star above the head, some 18 inches above the head, opens. This is your connection to the Akashic Records. Any programming coming up from other lifetimes in the soul that needs to be released, that can be purged, release back to the light. Release back to the light. Clearing through all layers, levels, dimensions of the Akashic. Clearing through all layers, levels, dimensions of the Akashic. Clearing all energies from the Akashic that can be cleared back to source light. 
enabling an update and reorganization of your Akashic to reflect a new level of light, a new level of potential. So there are energies that need to be purged and released. Allowing more light in from the central sun into that star. So it begins to pulse a kind of gold and magenta pulsing sun above the head. And Let's ask the Soul Star Chakra to begin to download positive energies, positive patterning down to the Crown Chakra that you want to awaken from other lifetimes. Positive patterning. as a download from soul star to crown and from crown down into every other chakra. Other lifetimes where you have awakened other potential, other talents, other abilities, other skills. Skills necessary for you in this lifetime. Open for a download of light into your field from soul star to crown and then rippling down all the way down from crown to base then down to third eye from third eye to sacral then down to throat from throat to solar plexus and then into the heart, the heart of your being. Allow that light into every cell of your body. So it becomes more tangible for you, more, more available to you in this lifetime. Just allow that breathe, sit with that for a moment.
allow your whole energy field to become more enlivened with light. More enlivened with light. Breathe open, soft and relax. Just allow the process. allowing all chakras to absorb as much light as they want to. From the Soul Star, feeling your connection more deeply to Gaia, the grid of the Earth, through the Earth Star below the feet. And breathing with your breath, allowing more light in on the out breath, releasing anything you want to release, Allow the purging to continue, allowing more light to come in on the in-breath. Following the cycle of breath. You may feel an intensification in your energy field as you allow this process. Just breathe and ground. The more you ground, the more the process continues. And just take your time following the cycle of breath. And then when you're ready, feel your connection to your body 
coming back to your body of bone and blood and breathing And as always, the meditation is offered to you with love and blessings, love and blessings. <laughs>